Well, here I've got the Klein Digital Circuit Breaker Finder. I was extremely skeptical about how this tool was going to work, but after using it for a while, it has been absolutely fantastic. It's been perfect in my own home for finding the breakers that various outlets are on. So I'm gonna show you how to use it, how it's working on my house. Make sure you watch this because a lot of people who give it a bad review aren't using it correctly. So I'm gonna show you how to use it correctly and show you how it works in this video. Now you have two different pieces here. This is the transmitter and this is the detector. And it is nice, they've made it so that the two nest together so that whenever you want to store it, you can just plug it together and you're not gonna lose one or the other and they're gonna to stay together. But what you wanna do first is plug your transmitter into the outlet that you want to find the circuit breaker for. Now I'm in my garage right now and this is about as far as I, away as I can get from the actual breaker panel. So I'm gonna go ahead and plug the transmitter in here. You see I got two green lights. I'm not gonna do anything else with it. Now let's go with our detector down to the breaker panel. Now here's a sub panel and I know that outlet is on this sub panel. So the first thing I'm gonna do is hit the power button on the detector and the tool needs to learn your breakers. So it's very important that the first thing that you do is run the tool over all of your breakers slowly. Then on your second pass, it will detect where the, uh, the transmitter is at. So right here, that's telling me that that is the one. And sure enough, I've got it labeled here, South Garage Receptacles. So that is the correct one. Also, it reads really well if you go over the bare wires. I got a little something there. But you can see south receptacles again. See if it picks up on any of these others. See, it's not picking anything up. Then whenever I come back across here, right there it is. Let's try another one. Here's a GFCI outlet here in my basement. Go ahead and plug it in. I got two green lights. Let's go over to the panel. Again, we just hit the power button on the detector. It's on and we want to let it learn the breakers. So run it across all of them once. I didn't get a real strong reading, so let's do it again. Right here. And you can see it says basement kitchen receptacles. Let's try one more. Here's the outlet for my sump pump in my basement mechanical room. Two green lights. inside sump pump. So as you can see, this tool works really well for me. I was very skeptical, but it's worked perfectly, exactly as it's supposed to work. If you've got a need where you're trying to identify which receptacles are on which breaker, this tool is gonna save you a ton of time versus flipping breakers on and off, trying to figure it out the hard way. So great value, great tool. I would definitely recommend